Hey guys, so I actually just got finished filming this tutorial. It'll be up. Um, but now I'm getting ready for bed. Um, well, to eat dinner and then go to bed. Uh, but I figured I'd do a get unready with me just to share some life updates with you. Uh, things that are going on with me and just, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Pop these hoops off. Yes, the braids are back. I love these gold hoops. I got them from like a beauty supply store. Um, but they were like in the case a little bit. They're not as cheap. Oh, <laughs> they weren't like the dollar ones. Um, I'm going to get a couple more pairs. These are like eight bucks, but they are like, they haven't turned or anything. And I like this thick gold hoop. I don't know. Yeah, I'm into the gold. Um, ooh. Um, but anyway, so, getting ready to, let, where do I begin, where do I begin, so, um, nothing bad or anything, I'm just, I'm a busy lady right now, so it's February 2018, I set big goals for myself in February, in February, for 2018, there's just different things that I wanted to do, different things that I wanted to finish, or whatever, and things like that, so, just some life updates, Nelson and I, um, we announced in a lot of that we were looking for a house, that we were house shopping, um, cool, lovely, stressful, um, and we found a house, However, we found one. This was like a starter home for us. We don't want kids or anything, by the way, but like a general, we want to move on up. We don't like the Jeffersons. So, <laughs> this house, um, I'm about to put my oil on my face. So I'm going to look like a monster. Um, this house, we, you know, made an offer. They accepted the offer or whatever. And then we go to inspection and we see some issues that we don't want to pay for. <laughs> we don't want to pay for. We're not getting to a home. That needs a whole lot of repairs and all of that. So if they don't fix them, then we probably won't take that house. And we'll stay here and rent for a little bit longer. Maybe do another year here while we save up and, you know, you know, that situation. So, I mean, I'm not disappointed or anything. Ain't nobody trying to spend, ain't nobody trying to be house poor or anything like that. Nelson makes good financial decisions and we talked about it and it's fine. Uh, so I might be moving it right now. We got to see. <laughs> Y'all updated. I don't know. Um, yeah, so that's all that's going on with that. That's all that's going on with that. Um, so my, I am in my final semester of my bachelor's degree, my undergraduate. I don't know if you guys know my situation with school. I graduated high school on time. I went straight to college, lived on campus and everything for a year and a half. Who looked crazy. It just, I wasn't ready yet. It wasn't for me. Like, I love school. I was the overachiever in school, a student, all this other stuff, athlete and all this. And I don't know, when I got to college, it wasn't like I partied all the time. And it's just, I don't know, I couldn't focus. I don't know, whatever. So I left. I left. I uh, worked full time for a year and I was like, no, I need an education. I love school. You guys, someone could pay me to just get degrees. Uh, that's what I do. I love school, but I was like, yeah, I got to go back to school. So I went to community college, graduated with my associates um, and then in biology. And then I went, uh, I take, I went back to my university and to finish my bachelor's. And my bachelor's is laboratory management. I am due to graduate in May 2018. So, I was like on a full load and like it was, I missed a class. Like I planned out all my classes. Like I talked to my advisor and I planned them all out. But for some reason I missed a class and so I had to take it this semester. I'm undergraduate this semester. So I'm taking like six classes this semester. Um, they are staggered. Four of them are like staggered because they have different sessions and things. But anyway, nonetheless, I've been a busy lady. So I'm like, okay. Oop. One of them is... One of them is, um, my last class is an internship. So, let me back up. I got a job at a lab. Um, this is before even my internship. I got a job at a lab, uh, because I taught, you guys knew I was a teacher. Um, I taught computer software at a, um, higher education place. And our campus closed. So, you know, everyone's looking for new jobs. Anyway, got a job as a in a lab. Love a lab. Have a biology degree. Boom good and you know the semester's coming up and I'm like well let me see if this can count toward my internship 
Thanks, I don't have to go see places. Needless to say, it did. Wonderful. So I'm working full time at the lab, getting my credit for my internship as well. So it, it worked out, it worked well. <laughs> so I go and I look for, um, because my lab job, I mean, to be honest, which was a pay cut down from my other job, anyway. But anyway, so I'm looking for a part-time job. I'm looking, and I'm like, okay, uh, you know, looking around. Needless to say, I go to a part-time job interview, and I fall in love with it. They fall in love with me, and they offer me a full-time position. Um, an amazing full-time position. Uh, I work, I still work at a lab, but now I work at a museum. I actually work at a science museum, and I'm marketing and STEM coordinator there, which is pretty cool. Um, so... I don't know the place, but I was like, my internship, still gotta do my internship, like, that's over in May. So I work at the lab part-time to get keep those hours, and I work full-time. And so I'm working 60 hours a week. Um, yeah, every day, I'm, I'm getting home at like 8 o'clock, I get up at 5, and while I'm not physically tired, like by Friday, yeah, you wanna get in the bed, but I'm not like physically tired each day. I'm taking advantage of my use, I'm be honest with you, I'm not like physically exhausted when I get home, I'm not. Um... And I fit schoolwork in there, um, in between. Uh, when I get home, I do just like a little bit each day. Uh, I'm feeling much better this week because two of my classes have dropped off. And I'll pick up two more next month. But, um, so they were like staggered with the schedule. Anyway. But I'm feeling pretty good. So yeah, that was like a big adjustment for me. And this all happened within like the last four weeks like in 2018 it, it all happened like in 2018 i was like oh my god me and nelson looking for this house and i'm like we gotta move we're trying to set dates if you know closing dates and different things around like you know graduation i'm like i'm gonna move before then nelson's birthday's in may it's it it, it was a lot so but that was a situation we're just gonna find out we're gonna wait and see and see what's going on um whew. still wiping off stuff using my micellar water and stuff now um, but anyway, so that, that's, it's still exciting, the whole house thing. Um, my new job, I got a job. I got a job. I've always had a job. New job. Um, so yeah, working two jobs, like at the end of the week, and not to mention, still other obligations, um, that I do, just like outside of work and stuff, I, uh, do, whew, do different things, planning different things. Uh, IMATS is one of them. I am still, I'm going to IMATS, someone asked me, I am going to IMATS, booked, Hotel is booked. Tickets are bought. Um, it's a bunch of us. So van has been reserved. We're written like a van to go up there. All oh, that's been reserved. Like that is a no brainer. Uh, with that being said, I've been having issues with my car. I need a new car. Um, I'm gonna probably buy a used. I'm gonna buy a used car. But I need a new car. My car. We put a lot of miles on it. Um, it's an older car. I don't have a car payment. That's the only thing. Like I own my car, right? Which is pretty cool. Um, take it to the shop tomorrow. See how much longer my baby has. And so that's another responsibility that me, um, that, not stressing me, just life updates. I'm, so, you know, what is Candace doing? I'm actively doing all these things at one time. Um, so, just craziness. Just craziness. With that being said, with my YouTube channel, I didn't want, I don't want to say it because I don't want to jinx it, but I'm going to say it. I am trying to upload a video every three days for uh, uh for 2018 i started i uploaded my first video like january 6th or 5th whatever whatever since the first video of, Jan of 2018 i have uploaded a video or a video has been published every three days with that being said i have to film in advance so right now this video i'll tell you now i am filming this video this is february 5th i do not know when it's going to be up it's probably going to be up I don't know. It's going to be up. I have videos scheduled. I've been doing really well with that. But I have to be on it. My filming time, I usually film during the weekends. This is a weekday. I'm actually filming on a weekday. I got home early. But um, I usually film during the weekends and I'm editing and uploading and having all that in advance. So during the week, I can focus on work and school. Um, but <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's exciting. Like, it's just the first half of the year. Because then when May is, I'm still like paying for school. So it's going to be one of those crazy situations where school want their coins. School want their coins. So it'll be one of those crazy situations where I graduate and then they're not going to give me my degree until my bill's paid. Like, that's what it's going to be. It's going to be one of those situations, but that's real. I don't care. It's real. Um, yeah. So. Uh, but yeah, hopefully I will. I'll keep you guys updated. School is not a race. If I need more time, if I need to retake a class or something, you know, it's rough. But two of my classes ended. I'm pretty sure. Well, I have A and one. I think I have a B and the other one. But 
yeah, like once May hits and all this is done, and I, I can relax. My birthday is in June. I don't know what I'm doing. It's turned 27. 27. If you guys don't know, I'm turning 27. That's, I don't know how I feel about it yet. I really don't know. Um, but Nelson and I are going, doing well. The guinea pigs are doing well. Christian's doing well in college. He'll be a junior. Now, Christian, my brother, my little brother, he will be 20 on February 25th. Like, craziness. 20 years old. 20 years old. My little brother will be 20 years old. That's crazy. Oh, anything else? What else? What else? I don't know. Um, but, yeah, just updates of my life. And I feel like, uh, I mean, it's not too personal information it's just what's going on with me and all that I'm doing and I don't want to neglect you guys and I'm actually not like I said I not physically exhausted at the end of the week yeah I'm a little tired like I'm getting to bed but I'm not like I get up on Saturday and I'm still I want to film and I'm ready to go and I'm blessed I guess it's, I'm just taking advantage of my youth I, I and I'm going I'm going to take advantage of it because It'll all come out in the end. It'll all it'll all pay off in the end. All the hard work you put in. If you just tired and you feel like, look. First off, take care of you. It's 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 there's nothing wrong with taking a break. There's nothing wrong with taking a mental health day. Taking days off work if you have to for your mental sanity. Trust me, I will take advantage of that and I will not overexert myself. But it's also okay to grind and hustle now and get your things together. So yeah. Um any makeup room additions? I don't know. If we are here another year, that gives me a whole another year to rearrange and redecorate. I'm, I like my setup now, but like, you know, it's another thing to do. Uh, anything else? I don't know. I'm going to wash my face in the bathroom and I'm going to eat. Um, but I just wanted to share so many things with you guys. My mom's doing great. Everyone's, everyone's doing okay. Um, it's nothing nothing you know everyone's blessed it's just I'm a busy lady you guys I'm a busy lady and I'm not complaining I'm not complaining at all but I was just I don't know you guys are my friends and I'm like child let me tell you what's going on so yeah braids are back me and my mom braided each other's hair this week <laughs> this past weekend I got off work at like seven o'clock drove down to my mom's house, which is like an hour and a half away from my job, drove down, and we <laughs> pulled all night, and we didn't go to bed until like four. I did hers, she did mine, and we, we was like, we getting this done. And then Saturday, I stayed the night at her house Saturday, we drove back home. That's how we roll. Um, but yeah, you guys, I have big plans. Other big plans for 2018, just in general, what I want to accomplish, personal goals, financial goals, um, like weight loss goals, things like that. Um, I have another project. I'm waiting for something to be delivered from Amazon. I do have a project that's going to be an ongoing, like, vlog video diary situation. I'm taking on a challenge that I've never taken on before. And I'm going to film it. And we're going to see how this shit turns out. So, that's all I have to share. If you guys want to share anything, talk to me. You can leave it in the comments. Oh, going live. Um, I am going to try to pick that back up. I can't with just explaining everything busyness. I cannot have a set schedule of them, but I will try to let you know on all my social media. Make sure you're following me on Instagram, Twitter. Um, make sure. I also have a Facebook page, Candice Victoria, but I have not done anything to it. Um, and I have a Snapchat. Follow me on Snapchat as well. But where announcements will be will be Twitter and Instagram. So you'll know when I'm going live, at least the day of or day before if I can. If I can. Um, but I will continue to go live on the weekends when I can. So, yeah. Yeah. So that's also there. Anything else? I still have carts. Like, I don't even have time to go to Sephora or Ulta. But... I have carts of things um, that I'm excited about. I do. I have carts, and I'm just like some of the things I'm gonna go to the store and swatch, and you know they're coming. Um, I'm I'm also okay with not having gone shopping in a bit. Well, one, we save money, but I'm at this coming, so I don't know. February, it's February, March, <sighs> two and a half months before you guys see a big haul. I don't know. But, um, yeah, there's so many, so many new things I'm following, trying to get into, but I just don't have time, sister. But, um, yeah, I just thank you all for supporting me. We're almost at 11,000 subscribers. We're almost, um, 
Yeah, we're almost at 11,000 subscribers, which is huge to me. Um, it might not be huge to a lot of people, but it, it is huge to me. I've been doing this for six years. I didn't even acknowledge my six-year anniversary. That's how busy I was. January 21st was my sixth year on YouTube. Um, and, yeah. It's a wild, wild ride. Um, you can see me just growing up. Growing up and... And... and changing settings and gaining a boyfriend through this journey and whew, and I am still down for the ride I am not stopping anytime soon it's too fun it's absolutely too fun um yeah I love you guys yeah don't hold me to the every third day because <laughs> I'm trying man I'm trying but definitely definitely at least a hundred videos in 2018 and I think I do that pretty well I have about 800 or so videos or 700 or so videos on my channel and I've only been on it six years so average it out it's a little over 100 a year so that's pretty good that's pretty good um but I want more I want more in quantity and more in quality so stay tuned anything else I don't know I've been rambling I'm hungry I'm gonna eat dinner cuddle with my boo I love y'all. I love you guys so much. If you want to share, if you want to talk to me, of course, you can do it in the comments or any of my social media. I love you all, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.